it's Chess's Kitchen of Friends. And today we're making coffee with nobody else, so it's kind of sad. Anyways, so let's cut to the chase. So we're going to be putting some coffee into this bad boy right here with the stars. And Washington, D.C. with Abraham Lincoln, Eiffel Tower, and the White House. Also, so we're going to be making some coffee, which I might have already mentioned. I did that very fastly. So you want to... First, you want to have for these kids that might be watching, you want to have a six cup if you want. Not too bad, not too shady, not too hot, not too shady, but it's good. So second, the step, well step one, you got to put coffee, you have to put water in there. You don't just put that red stuff there. Pour it all the time. And I think it's filled up. It's okay. Just guess what? This happened. So let's just get another one. I don't really care if it's wet. And there we go. Brand has me. Okay. Second step. You want to put this in here and you want it to make sure that you do not drop it. And it will break, I'm saying. Okay, so this right here is a filter, and I got a new one. It's kind of wet, but it's okay. Anyways, so what you want to do is you want to get this stuff, this bad boy right here now. There's already a spoon inside. This this will be our stir, stirrer. I don't know if that's a word. But let's put this in here. Nice and gentle. Okay. There we go. Okay, now you want to open this and you want to be really careful when you open it because it might just fly out if you do it too much. So we need six teaspoons of coffee. So we just pour it where the same thing went. And if you're <laughs> you don't. You don't. Did you put it in the water? Yeah. <laughs> no, you have to put it in the filter. You got to start all over. Sorry. Sorry, Dad. I forgot, I forgot. <laughs> hey, right, it's Chess's Kitchen and Friends, and today we are going to make some coffee. Now, I'll tell you what all the stuff is. So, there's going to be a secret ingredient, but I'm not telling all well, my family knows. This right here is our coffee thing. I don't know what it's called. But anyways, that's our little, that's our little guy, that's our helper. This is our coffee cup. For this bad boy, we're going to do that for later, the best for days. This is our filter, blah, blah, blah. This is our coffee. This is our coffee holders. It doesn't matter what kind you get. Oh, no. Gosh. Okay, so you want to pour this bad boy. Make sure I don't get it everywhere this time. We want to have six cup. If you have a measuring cup, then it will have six cups. Or eight, or ten, or twelve. Count by four. Or twos. Stir. Now this right here is a filter. But we, we need, we need, um, where's, there it is. We need this bad boy. I have no idea what it's called. I forgot the name of it. So, but first you gotta put this under. Gotta make sure it's right there. And you might, you might have to make sure it's right there. But there we go. Now you wanna place the filter in there and just like stuff it, like a flush. And you wanna get the coffee. Now this is what it looks like. Mmm, it smells good. Chocolate. Oh, no. So you want to have six spoons per cup. And that's why I'm a cat. No, person. one teaspoon per cup. One teaspoon per cup. That's why I'm a cat. Per cup of water, yeah. That's why I'm a cat person. Okay, so 
Imagine if a cat was making this. That would definitely be funny. So that was two. Mm hmm. That'd be three. And you just want to get a little bit. You just want to get like. A good teaspoonful. A, two, a good teaspoonful like this. Or if you want it a little smaller so you can be careful. Like if you do this, it'll be good enough. Is that six? If it doesn't turn out right, I don't care. That's okay. So you're going to have to taste it. I don't care what you think. You're going to have to drink it all. I'll just pour a little bit for you. I won't pour the whole thing. Okay. This bad. I'm going to cut it on and let it brew for a while. So it's doing. It's getting hot. Caution, kids. Do not touch to this. When you um, when it's going, it can be very hot. It can be very very hot. Okay, guys, it's done now. Now I gotta take this out. So we're just gonna pour it out much. Now for the ingredients. Okay, so we want. That French vanilla coffee creamer. Let's just get some of it. <laughs> That'd be good. I like it. Yeah. Okay, cut away because this is gonna be the special video. So do not, do not see, please. Okay, guys, I gotta tell y'all. Sorry, but the secret ingredient was this. It'll melt down in the coffee. So you gotta wait for a moment to cool it down, the cup, the Hershey, and the almond, so it makes a good mix. Also, I forgot to put in this dikes. Make it more um, better doing stuff in. Yep, there we go. I already see it being developed. Developed. So you can put it anywhere, and I see a little swirl now. Also, make sure you have parental supervision. Mm, it smells good. It smells like chocolate. Mm. So, taste tester. That, that's you. <laughs> I don't know if I want to taste it. I bet it's good. I don't like sugar in my coffee, though. I don't care. You have to taste it and put sugar. Okay. You like sugar. Hand it to me. Let me see. Are you going to taste it? No. All right, hand it to me. Let me see. Hot. Safety first. Remember, you got Yeah, Dad's the only one that can hold hot stuff. Oh, tell him about the special cup. And it's 4th of July today. Yeah, my grandparents bought this cup for um, the 4th of July when they went to Washington, D.C. We did not order this cup. I repeat, we did not. I did not want it. It's authentic. Yeah. Oh, I see the chocolate. Ooh, I see the chocolate in there. That's funny. Ooh. Don't pour it out. How do you like it? Actually, it's really good. I taste the like the mocha. You know, when you put chocolate and coffee, they call it mocha. It's actually pretty good. Maddie's jealous. <laughs> Maddie can whip up some coffee, can't she? Yeah, I can't Me? That's Miss Thang. This is real life, y'all. Mm. You want to try it? Yeah. It's good. Don't burn yourself. Safety first. Yeah, if I'm, this is also going to be my restaurant called Chester's Kitchen and Friends. So me and Dad are going to be this, like, the, the owners of this place. Yeah, we got some great recipes we can do. Mm -hmm. See you next time. I'm going to make another one for my next customer. Bye. Should I make some more?